Hello people of the wild, today we are going to find my dream home, but in order to find my dream home, we need to find my dream location first. That is why I'm going to be doing a quiz. Where should I live? I don't know, I didn't look it up yet. What kind of weather do you prefer? Weather, 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 weather. What kind of weather do you prefer? What kind of weather? What kind of weather? <laughs> what kind of weather do you prefer? The best time to wear a striped sweater. What type of weather do you prefer? What type of weather? Weather, 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 weather. What type of weather? What type of weather do you prefer? What type of weather do you prefer? What type of weather do you prefer? It's, okay, I think I got it. What type of weather do you prefer? This is Hope. Say hi, Hope. How important are sports in your life? I want to be Spider-Man. I want to lift 600 times my own body weight. No, I do not want to live in a duplex at all. I lived in a duplex. I hate it. I hate it. There's just, I'm living in a duplex right now. I fucking hate duplexes. Give me my own goddamn space. I hate that they can hear me and I can hear them. I would like more than what a foot of wall between us. I would like at least 20 feet between houses. What? Are they seriously asking this? How ethnically tolerant are you? What year was this published? It doesn't even say. Um, segregation? No. No, I'm good. I would like at least 20 feet between houses. If you could choose any era to live out of the following, which would it be? I guess I'll do 1980s. <laughs> Speaking of 1980s, I have the side pony and everything. And the scrunchie! Manhattan, New York is what I got. No! No, 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 no. No, this is wrong. No, no, I'm taking a different one. I don't like when things are in too much of a rush, when things are always going on. Zip, zap, zoop. I, I can't deal with that. I can. I don't think I could live in a city. I don't know why I didn't go on BuzzFeed. BuzzFeed is the epitome of these quizzes. How do you take your coffee? I like my coffee very as pale as me. Add a lot of sugar, add a lot of cream, you get me. Why is there not a freaking sugary milk with a shot of coffee? What could you eat forever? Pasta. There are so many ways you can make pasta. You can have it just plain, plain with butter or oil. And I like that with a little bit of garlic pepper. Or you can have it in lasagna. Or you can have it with pesto sauce. Or you can have it in baked ziti or you can have it ravioli. Ravioli is a pasta, you can stuff it. They don't even have pasta. What do you look for in a mate? A mate? Like a friend? No, they're kissing, so like a partner? <laughs> well, I do find smartness very, very alluring, very. How the fuck do you know all these things? Like, dude, tell me more, just keep talking to me. But there's been some dumb, dumb people I've had crushes on, like, dude, you are so dumb. Why am I practically in love with you? Pick your ideal last meal. Lasagna, cause I'm fucking Garfield. Portland, you are a free spirit, but not in the LA way. You're probably more cultured than most of your friends. What? I'm not very cultured. You have to date on all the latest coffee. I worked in a coffee shop for two weeks. I'm really not up to date with that. Move to Portland already, you sexy smarty pants. So far we have Portland and Manhattan. I'm gonna do one last one. What? Have to take a survey to get the thing? I'm gonna screw up your results because nobody wants to do that shit. New York, New York. Why does everyone want to put me in New York? I was hoping I'd get something like country. No, I, think I can't get something country because I don't like the harsh winners. I want somewhere like peaceful. I want to live on a farm. I want a bunch of cats and cows and horses. But okay, let's start searching in Portland and New York. Let's start with New York since it's closest to me and I've actually been to New York before. I put a list together of what I'm looking for. I am looking for something with a backyard, preferably enclosed, two to three bedrooms, and then windowsills so my cat can sit in the window and possibly maybe a bay window. No, no, see this? This, I don't like this. This right here, how you look outside and you're just in line with somebody else's eye view, somebody else's window? No, 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 definitely not. Get that out of here. 
this is nice look at this backyard look how big the backyard is I could have several several I could put a tire swing in that tree that could be fun but one problem is that it is right next to someone's house I like my privacy I don't like this right here no I don't know where I'm going to live where I can literally just just it's just my house it's it's one road and at the end of the road is just my house nobody else nobody else just me and my house I should probably look into like very expensive places oh my god this place is a million dollars million dollars hey well this is looking too much like a McMansion for me no no thanks yeah no this totally has McMansion vibes let's see the most expensive stuff in New York 65 million dollars <laughs> tiniest stupidest pool you're telling me we have all this house space you want to shove this in here this is so tiny at least make it double this then it would be acceptable does this even go that deep this doesn't even look that deep unless that wall comes up this pool is practically pointless for the size of this house and it has one two three four 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 chairs in there no no oh this is a little bit more my speed look how homey do i own that dock too what do i need all that for like i'm buying the house right because it looks like you're selling me the dock wow that's that is big does it have a pool house no now this is what I'm talking about. This is the size pool you should have in your house. Not that teensy teensy witty one. If you're gonna go in an outdoor pool and you live on a lake. That is insane. A tennis court, okay, we're going a little far and above and beyond. Oh my God, that garden. This is a whole ass estate. Well, obviously it's $45 million. Let's widen the search because I'm from New Jersey. Let's see the most expensive houses in New Jersey. There's not a lot of $20 million homes in New Jersey, but there is one for sale in Red Bank, New Jersey. Wow. This reminds me of the time I climbed a, a, a freaking a lighthouse. I don't want these types of stairs in my home. See, you know what this house said? They said make it lavish but make it quaint like we still want to have a homey type feel we still wanted to feel like home and not like your lip oh my god they want to make you feel like you're just in grandma's grandma's living room yeah i feel it there right right down to the tapestry on the wall too i feel it y'all i'm so sorry i'm so sorry my videos always start out where i'm sitting up and i got perfect posture but then i just slouch and slouch until you can't see me anymore I flipped it so this video could actually see me, but now it's slower quality. Do you want to see me in half my glory or do you just want to see the top of my head? Either way, it's still half my glory. Okay, so this was the type of houses. My, oh my god, I'm still doing it even though I see myself. I just sit in a slouch. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Alright, let's just let's look up Portland. Let's see what's in Portland. I kind of like this one. I like this one a lot. I love how there's a tree right in front of all the windows where you can't see so you can't see in i actually love that on ironically i kind of love this this is a cute house i like the door i like how it's just a little pop color and like that's like my favorite shade of blue too i like these houses they're so cute this one's much cuter than the other one it looks like a little doll house it's so quaint is that the right term oh no 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 I'm not having carpeting all over my my house. No way, Jose. But it's the pretty color I was telling you about. All in the back room. I don't know. What's with that counter space? Is this the bathroom? Oh, shh. This is the kitchen? Oh, God. Never mind. I mean, I love that color and all, but I'm not... I'm not... That's a lot of space to take up that color. In a bathroom, I would like it in the bathroom, but in, I mean, I can always paint it. I can always paint it. But the carpets, man. No, 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 no. All right, all right. Let's see the most. 
seven million dollars. Most expensive is what I was going to say. Oh my god. Are we looking at the front or the back of the house? I would assume the back. Did they have animals? What is this? They must have had animals. This looks like a horse jumping over thingamabob. Oh, it's so big though. I don't like how big it is. And I don't want, like, I don't want housekeepers or like, maybe a chef. I could do a chef, but I don't want to have like housekeepers and stuff keeping up with my own house. I don't want my house to be too big that I need help cleaning it. Like these windows, oh my god, those windows. I need a ladder to clean these windows. I don't understand how people have fuzzy chairs at a dinner. It's like, dude, you're gonna spill spaghetti sauce on that. I, I forgot, they're rich. They can just replace it, get it dry cleaned or whatever. You, you can't dry clean a chair. Ooh, <laughs> this photographer was like, let's get a little artsy. <laughs> Whoa, are those the mountains? You can see the mountains from here? You can. Oh my goodness. I just want to slide down these halls just on my socks. This one doesn't look like it should be $5 million. Is it just me? Yeah, it's a big house. Let's, let's see what they have to offer. Why is this $5 million? You're right near the city, I see. Oh, it's the inside. I really think it's a location that's upping its price. Unless it comes with all this wine too, that makes a lot more sense. Dude, is that turf? Because if that's not real grass, that's just sad. Why, who would want to go sit in the grass and stare off into the city? Sit in fake grass. I don't, I don't like that. No, it has to be real because there's, there's things growing. I still don't think this would be five million dollars. Maybe like two million, but five million? First that seven million one we just saw. The whole ass estate. Okay, it looks, a, it looks a lot bigger here. In my head, when I look at this house, all I hear is <laughs> Definitely. Oh my god. I hate these rugs. I hate these rugs with burning passion. Don't like it. I don't like it. Okay, so the rugs, they're just such a strong pattern on with themselves. It's just that this ottoman and these pillows, they're just, it's really meshing and it's just very, it's a real big eyesore to me to be looking at this house with all this. How close is this blue to the other rugs? Oh my god, they really like these rugs. I hate these rugs. Okay, let's go to LA. That's where all the influencers live. Los Angeles, California. Oh, those gatos, California. I would love to play, be in a place called the Cats. Wow, this house is incredibly cheap. Why is this house only six thousand dollars? In LA. What the hell? Why is it six thousand dollars with nine bedrooms, four baths? Something's not right here. I think they must have missed is a, a zero or a couple of zeros in here. Like it looks perfectly fine. Why is it only? Six thousand dollars. Tell me, Day, Mr. Her, why is it only six thousand dollars? There's not a lot of pictures online either. I'm thinking it might be gutted or something. Hey guys, if we all chip in, I think we can get this house. There's what? Ten of us? No, scratch that, because there's only like four of us that really watch it. So what is one hundred sixty million divided by four? It's forty million. If we each pitch in forty million dollars. We can get this. You guys have $40 million just lying on hand, right? Bitch, I don't even have $5 just lining in hand. Lining, laying on hand. Lining? What is he trying to say? I really don't like these fancy estate houses. But I do like, like, the privacy of them. Because I've been seeing some of these top-down views. And it's like, they have this big old land just to themselves. With no one else around. I like that part. Guys, what kind of houses do you like? Do you prefer, like, old money? Or like new money like this house here like the modern houses or do you prefer like obviously this is a mansion but like this is like a modern mansion the most likely places of where i would move to i currently live in new jersey i would probably move to another part of new jersey but more like the the garden state side more farm side or i would move to i love because that's why i would move there have you ever gone down a kind of what's the road called 
a highway. Have you ever drove down an interstate and, is that, am I using that right? I don't know, I don't drive. What is an interstate? Here's what I found. So an interstate is a highway, so that didn't help me at all. But like, not the freaking like four lane highways. Is it a highway? I think it might just be a road. A really long stretch of road. And you're going down and like, there's just fields of grass and more grass and more grass and then house. Grass, 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 house. Oh, cows, horses. What is that type of area called? I just keep calling it farmland, but it's not always farmland because it's, it's, yes, you do see a lot of crops and animals but there's just a bunch of grass too of just pure land maybe montana maybe i'd move to montana or wyoming i've never been to wyoming and i've never been to montana so why would i want to move there because it's beautiful at least in my imagined head it is <gasps> give me give me this give me this right now oh my fucking god i want this no i don't even need to look inside do you see that do you see all the space and privacy we have away from everyone? I want my house to be dropped right in the middle of a field. Please and thank you. What's up with these these photographers getting all artsy on us? No, it's it's real estate. <laughs> real estate agents who have a DSLR and they sneak in photos like this one. I always think these things look like chocolate. I want to bite these. I want to gobble them down. See, this house is really interesting. Yes, we can have animals. Fuck yes! There's a goat and there's a cat right there. If I was rich, I'd buy this type of house. <laughs> and of course, if I had the time to take care of all these animals. I know the cat and the goat doesn't come with the house, but... Oh, but the one thing I'm forgetting about... We still have winters. They still have winters in Wyoming and Montana. Ooh, harsh, cold winters to be exact. I just want to run away from the winters. We didn't check out Hawaii, but I don't want to be one of those people that just, because Hawaii is such a small place already. I don't just want to be one of those outsiders that just come in and just move to Hawaii because it's sunny. I don't want to do that. I don't want to just take their space but i was literally just about to move to wyoming just because i even have horses where would you live like would you would you guys be comfortable living in a big mansion like that? all right guys i think we're gonna end there what if i got a surgery to lift my eyelids all the way up there <laughs> hi oh my god <laughs> but look at all my eyelid space <laughs> Yeah, if it doesn't touch the eyebrows, then it's eyelid space. Honestly, thank you for watching if you made it this far. Thanks. Bye. Have a nice day.